All right, so we are here at the Field to Table Club. Can you tell me what that program is? So the program basically came about, we had uh, kids in the kitchen um, that had gone on when there was some days off school and then we thought uh, it would be really cool to tie in a garden club with it. <laughs> so basically field to table is what comes out of it. Uh, Glenda McPhee is doing the garden club um, aspects. So the kids are starting from the absolute basics with planting. Uh, they planted all of their uh, vegetables and the flowers that will be in the flower beds outside of Arts Forward. And Glenda, every step of the way, is teaching them everything about the plants and exactly how to do stuff. Um, they are going to be planting in four garden boxes that Men's Shed is building for us that will be outside just on the art corner of Arts Forward. Um, and the kids will be looking after that all summer all the way through to harvest and the idea with the kids in the kitchen part of it is Tony Ferguson is doing that part. Her and Glenda work together and figure out what's ready uh, for recipes each time that we have a session and then Tony incorporates whatever the kids are growing in those recipes for that session. Um, and it's been really cool. The kids have tried some, some really neat stuff. Uh, one that stuck in my mind was they had wheatgrass smoothies. I didn't know how many were going to try it. All of the kids tried it. Really? 17 out of 18 liked it, which was just That awesome. is, I want to quote that statistic everywhere because that is fantastic. <laughs> it is, it is. And you know, because a wheatgrass smoothie is green, but yeah. it tasted great. And the kids, yeah. the kids are very adventurous with what they're trying. Yeah. Um, I got an email from a parent actually yesterday who was saying, um, how excited the kids are about planting and the thought of spring coming and wanting to try different vegetables and that's what this is about is, is that's amazing to hear and certainly they're tending the boxes here but I imagine a lot of them are going to be growing yes. at home as well they've been uh, each session they get to take home plants so uh, this past session on Monday they took home tomatoes and peppers I do believe and it was interesting because some of the kids because we have um, siblings a couple mm -hmm. of siblings they wanted to ensure that they didn't take the exact same thing home that their other sibling did so that they could have quite a variety. Oh, yeah. So it was really good that the kids thought about it. And this program, I will say, is thanks to the Manitoba government through Prairie Mountain Health. Um, their Healthy Together Now grant. Yeah. Uh, they were, it's a huge proponent as to why this program is even be able to, to be a go. And um, we were able to really keep the kids' registration fees down to a minimum um, for a five month course. So Which is incredible and, and yeah, certainly would cool. allow more participation from certain certain families. Yes, yes. And we, we even um, were able to, with the grant, we have a deaf student that is taking mm -hmm. this, this program and we were able to hire an ASL translator to work with him. So that he could get as much out of this program. That is fantastic. Is. So for us, it's it's pretty important that we can include everybody. And from the positive reaction from the kids, they're loving this. And so are the instructors. It's I will say Glenda walks out of here after every session so excited to see the kids so excited about gardening. And Tony's loving teaching the kids about cooking and all the different aspects in the kitchen. So it's been really good. They both have such a passion for what they do. I guess they love to share it. They absolutely do. We're very, very lucky with that, for sure. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for that. We'll have to check in, you know, throughout the spring and summer yes. and th see how things are progressing. Yes. Yes, absolutely. So, All right, thanks. After blooming, the next step is beans. Oh, right here. Here's a bean. Right there. Oh, yeah, there is a bean. It's not ready to eat yet, but it started. Cool. Okay. And our, our tomato, see this guy? Oh, he's not happy. So I, once I took, I had the, the, basil plants and stuff all sitting here. So once I took that out, it flopped over. So I think I'm just going to kind of, remember how we, we those of you that were here last time, remember how we planted higher about, around the plants? So it'll stay up. So that'll stay up. So that's what we're going to do here, hopefully. No worries. So I'll just walk around with it, but you can see it in the bottom it's making the basil butter. So once you've had a look, just let me go by and let other people have a look. See how in the bottom part, it's getting really nice. We just need those top chunks to get caught in there. I but it smell it. Can you smell? I 
Are you sure we didn't put in enough? You didn't. You don't think we put in enough garlic? Is that what yeah. you said? You didn't put in enough garlic. Well, well, I don't think so. We put one. We have. We put half the garlic. We're here with Lorene, uh, one of the participants of Filter Table Club. So, have you been enjoying your time here in the club? So, what you're, what are you doing? Planting and what? Planting and cooking. Cooking, yeah. So are you, what are you, are you enjoying what you're doing? Yeah. What are you planting? Uh, we planted um, tomatoes, beans, and lots of flowers. Uh, and flowers. And what have you been cooking? Okay. Thank you, Lorene. We're here with Iva, one of the participants of the Field to Table Club. So how has it been going? Are you enjoying it? Yes. Yeah. Have you been uh, planting, uh, some, doing some planting also at, at your home or after this one, after here? I've been planting a sunflower at my house and now i got more plants to take care of. Okay. Yeah, thank you, Iva. <laughs> One more person. Okay. Who took basil home last time? Just back. Mm. I wonder if anybody's going to want to take a plant home this time. Okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. okay. <laughs> yep. Uh, hmm. Let's go with it. Let's go above this one. No, oh, just the ledges. That's it. Yep. Great. <coughs> as a garden club and uh, we've planted things, we've, har we've already been harvesting, we harvested a bunch of basil today and uh, we're transplanting, learning how to plant uh, mostly food but we also planted some flowers and some herbs today and uh, we're, we're just learning to, to grow things and appreciate and make observations, watch, watching things grow and change. Mm -hmm. And then uh, with Miss Ferguson, they're they're taking what we grow and using that so that uh, they're learning uh, different things that they can do with what they can grow. Okay. How long has this, this been this club our, running? Yeah. This is our third time now. Mm -hmm. I, I did formerly have a garden club at HMK, but so we've got the grow light downstairs that we had there, and um, so we hope we can we can grow it all summer. We're going to get some planting boxes put outside, so we will transplant things into there later on. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and then next fall, we'll have to get creative of what we can grow inside again with the grow lights. And just so, keep on. So we're hoping that it's a continued project. Continued project. So is this uh, sponsored by any organization? I know or? that uh, Mrs. Mm -hmm. Lee, uh, she got a, a grant. Mm -hmm. So there's different organizations that have uh, sponsored. The, the club and um, yeah, the, the the equipment downstairs is actually from a, an organization called Green Thumbs, Ooh, and it's sponsored okay. by Angry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah. I've seen that there are lots of kids participating. Yeah. So I yeah. We've got 18, 18. 18 or 18 signed up. So oh, okay. in our little room downstairs, it's a little a little squished, but once we're outside, it'll be a lot of fun. Okay, so uh, so after the uh, during summertime or uh, I, I hope that we yeah, meet you will be... more frequently then because there will oh, okay. be changes all the time outside. Okay, yeah. 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 Okay, thank you so much. Okay. Thanks.